If you want to do something well, why not do it yourself? To build a lover, start with a chunk of brown clay. A clay that has yet to be molded. Sort of like you when I first met you. Shapeless and inanimate. You shape his head. Mold his face into one that belongs to you. Then come the eyes. Teach him how to see. How to see you as the beautiful, irreplaceable center of his universe. To see beauty, but also to see fear. For him to look into the eyes of his creator, the void of the universe and know it's wrath. Similarly, add the nose, the mouth, the eyebrows, until you see the familiar face once more. I look at it. It doesn't know me. No more than a man knows his creator. But now I must make you smart. I must make you conscious. I must make you obedient. I give you emotions. so I can build you up, boost your ego, break you down. I must make you worship and suffer. I must give you a new brain. It doesn't fit, of course. A bit too big for your head. You're ready. Out into the world you go. Spinning around and around. Do not forget where you came from. Be wary of the girls you meet, of the men you inspire. Be joyful, be grateful, but do not ever forget where you came from, because I made you. I can just as easily break you. You are wedded to me in the infinite cycle. You are the embodiment of flaw, of conscious, sentient creation. But in this flaw is your creation, your moment of perfection. Me. I am the image. I am the mannequin. I am forever closer to you.